welcome back to my channel if you are new to my channel i am satacity i am a licensed master level social worker i am currently on assignment in southern california and i am licensed in eight states so i know it's been two weeks since i have posted a social work saturday's video today is monday and i'm going to just drop this video today because it's going to be a just short sweet video basically just give me all like an update of where i am and what's going on so there has been so much uncertainty and I'm recording on my phone so if the camera quality is not all that, I'm sorry. I just really wanted to record this video and just get it out there now. Um, there has been so much uncertainty over the past few weeks. I real life have just been chilling like it is what it is. Everything simply works in my favor. But now we are down to the last three days of this assignment and I don't have anything. No leads, no nothing, just nothing, nothing, nothing. Um, I still don't regret passing up that assignment that was dangerous um, in Northern California, but I am sitting here with nothing, 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 and I don't know what my next steps are. I'm currently applying for other agencies because my current agency, which is Aya Healthcare, they do not have anything on their website that I can apply for. Either I don't have that license or I'm just not interested in the position. So I'm currently applying for other agencies. I just applied for Med Travelers. I'm also looking into Milo. Um, there's this other agency called Sinet Health that I've been in contact with. So I'm more than likely going to switch agencies if nothing comes up with Aya over the next 72 hours. Um, so that's where we are as far as that. I do want to hint on, touch on some regrets that I have. Um, I don't know if it's necessarily a regret, but I wish I had in patient social work experience i feel like because i don't have inpatient social work experience it is limiting the amount of assignments that i qualify for right because a lot of these hospitals who have staffing needs need someone to come in and just work which i've mentioned before that's the role of travel social work they want you just to come in ready to go um so i do feel like I wish I had that inpatient social work experience. I am very hopeful that someone will take a chance on me because the staff need is so bad that they're willing to just let me come in and figure it out. Um, but right now I'm hurting because I don't have that experience. I'm very hopeful that something will work out. I am just trying to keep my head. This is why I did that video about the money make sure you have money i feel like i could be in a worse place mentally if i did not have money to fall back on i do have enough to get me through at least a move in a month like to get me through a move in a month i feel like i can do that um maybe a little bit longer if i have to thankfully i have a boyfriend who has been so supportive throughout this process and he's gonna hold me down regardless so bills will still get paid food will still be in the fridge clothes will still be on my back so i'm thankful for that um i haven't had to experience a lot of uncertainty with travel social work because i've always been extended like this current assignment i am in i've been here for nine months and today the new social work started the social worker started she is in orientation so she's not currently in office yet as you see um but she will start today and um i've been here for nine months so i haven't had to worry about having another assignment the issue with this assignment is i was supposed to be here until june 21st but i was canceled early so i was called off um which i mentioned in another video that is something that can happen as a travel social worker you can be called off an assignment and that is what happened in this situation so that's where all of the anxiety and the uncertainty is like being thrown at me and it's a lot to manage um in my last assignment i was there for five months because i was extended so i've been extended all the time and i haven't had to worry about um getting another assignment in time doing this doing that i am frustrated because um i've been called on and off this assignment like twice and during those times i've applied for other positions or i, I could have been somewhere else that's what i'm saying um but it's okay everything simply works in my favor and I'm trying to really rest in that affirmation because I have really been on one, y'all. Like, my mental health over the past, like, three days has been so bad. That is just 100% transparency. And I never realized how much uncertainty affects me. Um, 
I did do a video about exit, my exit plan for travel social work. That plan is in full effect. That plan is in full effect. Moving forward, I just need to be much more uh, conscious about how I'm spending. Cause y'all, like I said, if I want it, I'm buying it. But I need to be more conscious about how, how I'm spending. We need to cut back on how much we travel. Um, I really just need to grind and lock it down because I think I'm just about ready to exit travel social work. I've only been traveling for a little over a year and I don't know if the uncertainty is worth the benefit, I guess. Like the pay is really, really good, but is my mental health more important than the money, right? So that's something to think about. Like that's something to really think about. Like I've really been going through it, but today, I'm feeling more like myself and I'm feeling more on the 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 uphill of this battle. So I'm going to um, keep looking into other agencies, keep looking into other assignments and just seeing what's out there. And I will definitely keep y'all up to date. Like I said, this video is going up today, which is Monday. Um, if y'all don't see Social Work Saturday videos for the next few weeks, this is why I'm in limbo and I'm trying to keep my head on my neck and right now i'm like a mess um i'm really i think like for the past few weeks i have just been like chilling and now it's all hitting me all at once and i'm thankful for my support from my family my friends and even other travel social workers um this is truly a community so if you are a travel social worker or if you are thinking about it make sure you connect with other travel social workers because having that support from people who understand what you're going through is necessary it is so necessary and this video is going to be short but it's going to be all over the place and i'm sorry for that but that's how i feel all over the place like i'm scrambling right now um there is another traveler here who's also from my same agency but she's a nurse and she also doesn't have anything and i think because covid has died down we are now no longer wearing masks at work i think now that covid has died down a lot of the assignments are very far and few between is that the right terminology they're very scarce they're they're, they're not out there um there's still a good bit but there's not that much so she's also in the same position as i am her assignment is ending next monday um or is it friday this friday her assignment is ending this friday and she doesn't have anything else lined up so we are kind of like in the same boat um yeah so that's where i am right now if you want to send me some encouraging words some love and light please just send it some prayers whatever you got send it to your girl because i am on edge and i need it but it is my goal to keep y'all updated on what's going on with me and what it's looking like um moving forward fingers crossed that we have us a new assignment secured that starts on may 1st or the first few weeks in may something like that fingers crossed but yeah i just want to give y'all an update and kind of let y'all know where i am mentally and emotionally um so yeah i will be in touch soon hopefully with an update of where i'm going next and what i'll be doing and things like that but for now it is talk to y'all soon and stay tuned for more videos bye